Yo, what is happening? It's Abdin. Today, Defaultio has just dropped one of the biggest updates in like five years. It is absolutely crazy, guys. I am so pumped for this, if you can't tell. This is absolutely insane. And guys, I haven't actually explored this update too much. All I've seen is pictures, and from what I can tell, it is absolutely crazy. There is so much new content in this update. I am so excited. But anyways, let's get straight into it. So to get to it, from what I can tell, it is across the bridge. It's kind of like a safari extension. So you're just going to want to go across the bridge. You want to lower it. And guys, I am absolutely pumped for this because from what I can tell, there's a new shop. There's like a new biome or two. I don't even know. There is so much new content. It's been a while since we've actually gotten an update. And so this is going to be a real refresher. And guys, if you're logging onto the game right now, I will warn you, it might not be updated for you yet. It does take a little bit for servers to update. So you just have to be a little bit patient. So once the bridge gets full, down you just want to drive straight like I'm doing here just like if you are going to Bob's shack you don't want to take any turns on the road just keep going straight and then once you get to this rock right here you kind of want to wrap around similar to what I'm doing right here and guys if you don't remember there was an update about three years ago that added a peninsula near Bob's shack well defaultio has finally done something with that after years Finally, and now you can see there is a brand new bridge, a sign, and obviously the glowing trees over there. We'll get to that in a moment. But anyways, let's read this sign. So it says, Welcome to the Safari Extension. The following content will remain until April the 5th. So basically that means that all of this will go away after the 5th. So you want to get on this really, really fast. So I would recommend getting on the game as soon as you're done watching this. Maybe check what day it is so you can make sure that you have enough time to get this. It also says that all items purchased will remain in circulation. However, wood slash planks will be deleted. So basically, you can't keep the wood, but you can keep all of the items from the stores. So this is going to be super exciting. We'll have more items to trade, which is always a great addition. So I think that wood that is put into a blueprint is probably pretty safe because it just says wood slash planks. It doesn't say anything about blueprints. So yeah, I would recommend getting some of this wood and putting it into blueprints. Hopefully that will stay on your base. But anyways, with that said, let's go ahead and go across the bridge. So yeah, it looks like there is a brand new shop called Timber R Sus, and obviously there is a bunch of new trees. I can't wait to see what's inside. But anyways, let's go ahead and go inside this new shop. So it looks like straight off the bat there is a brand new vehicle. I can't wait to see what that is. And then over here it looks like there is a YouTube axe. This is absolutely crazy. This has been very requested. I can't wait to see how fast it is. I actually can't wait. I'm just going to go ahead and see how fast it is right now. It actually looks really good. So let's go ahead and go outside. Let's test it out first on this brand new tree. And it kind of looks like Defaultio has forgotten to add the animation to this axe in particular. Of course, no update is perfect, so obviously there's going to be some bugs. But Defaultio, if you are watching, this is probably something you should fix. But yeah, it looks like there is pink inside of this new tree. I am so happy. We've been waiting for pink wood for forever, so this is actually so exciting. I'm just really hoping that you're going to be able to save this wood inside of blueprints. It's going to be super cool if that's the case, if you're able to save this wood, because you're going to be able to build with incredibly rare wood. There's going to be collecting, and oh, I'm getting so excited about this. All right, I'm going to figure out what's inside of this tree. It's actually taking quite a while, so I'm going to cut until it's open. Alright, so it looks like there is pink inside, which is actually quite exciting, because we've been waiting for pink wood for the longest time. Anyways, I've gotten a little bit carried away. Let's go ahead and go inside and see what else there is. Alright, so it looks like there is a brand new speed car. This is actually quite exciting, because it probably goes pretty fast. And Lumber Tycoon is quite known for being super slow in terms of transportation, so this is going to be super convenient. 
And then over here, that looks like there's a glass max. This is just basically a sawmill, but it's glass. And then over here, this is actually going to be super helpful. There is golden conveyors. So these are going to be super helpful for many projects because they are, of course, gold. And then over here, it looks like there is brand new magenta prints. This is super exciting. Looks like there is three new ones, and I suspect that there's going to be more in the future. So it looks like there's a table, a wooden sawmill, which is going to be very, very helpful. And then there's also a thin door, which is going to be super, super useful. Oh, but that's not all. There is also, and I think this is going to be the most useful out of all of them, the box truck. I know, I know, this is probably the most requested item of all, and now it's in the game. So yeah, this is probably going to be the most useful out of all of them. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and buy all of these and then take them all back to my base. Alright, let's go ahead and test all of these out, starting with the box truck, which is of course the most useful out of all of them. As you can see, it's a box truck, it's a box in a truck, it's a box truck. Dude, honestly, this is amazing, bro. I cannot wait to use this to grind and everything, this is gonna be so useful. And guys, if you're new to this game and you don't understand why this is so important, it's because it's got a box in the truck and it's a, it, it, it's a box truck. All right, next up we have the glass sawmill. Just be careful not to break this. It is very fragile. But yeah, you can see through it, and it's pretty neat. All right, and finally we have the speed car, which, as expected, is pretty speedy. All right, back to what we were doing. This is not the only biome that is new. There's actually another one behind it. You just have to follow the road like this and then go up the slope. And then as you can see, there is a very lush biome over here. I think this is Testwood, which was one of the first trees ever made in this game. Defaultio decided to finally add it back. And then there's also street light wood, which is like street light it's it's a street light it's wood it's 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 street light wood and there's also some brand new buildings in this biome but i don't think you can go in them which is pretty lame but anyways going past that you can see that there's a brand new island with some brand new purple trees i'm actually gonna go see if i can cut this oh it's it's actually pretty hard i'll be right back and finally, and as you can see, there is actually pink wood, which is pretty cool because we've been wanting pink wood in this game for forever, and Defaultio actually finally caved. This is actually going to be super, super convenient to build with. But anyways, there's one more store in this update, and it's called It's the Yes Sand Lore, which is pretty cool. It's actually a pretty clever name if you think about it. But anyways, let's go ahead and go inside and see what they've got. So, who is this? It's Defitio. Oh, oh my gosh. I've uh, I've always wanted to meet Defitio. Oh, this is this is actually pretty cool. Well, let's go ahead and see what Defitio is selling. Looks like he's selling beds and then also a b broken lamp. Okay. And then blue dynamite. Ooh, I'm actually really excited to try that out. Let's go ahead and do that. Detonate! Run, 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 run. Okay. And then leak. 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 Pick up leak. Leak. Oh, and leak cut tree. Alright, so at this point, I thought that was all that there was left in this update, but I looked over and I saw some trusses over here. They're kind of hard to see. They're a bit transparent, but I'm going to go up and see what's over there. There's got to be something up there. Why would Defaultio add some ladders up a cliff if there wasn't something up there? But yeah, so let's go up and see what's up here. Alright, I'm up here and I'm not really seeing anything. I'm hoping that Defaultio didn't just troll us. I mean, it is the 1st of April, so maybe, but I don't know. Defaultio isn't one for tricking people, so... Yeah, so far nothing, but... Uh, wait, what is this? Um, uh-oh. 
Uh oh, uh oh, not good, not good, abort, abort, sideways people, oh god, save us, uh, there's sideways people, I repeat, sideways people, oh god, oh, this is not good, this is not good, why is there so many tilted people, oh no, guys, I don't know what to do, and now there's picnic baskets, are you kidding me, what is happening, what is Oh, and also there is actually no update because it's April Fool's and I got you. Goodbye.